time to learn a little something about pets. You All ready? Right, let's do it. Let's learn a little something about a dog that might not be the best one for your particular situation. Here with our good friend Kathy Erickson, if pets could talk is what we call this segment where we teach you a little bit something about your pets that you might not have known. And Kathy, we need to talk about, first of all, the dog is sitting right in front of us right now. Right. This is Libby. This is uh, this is my German short hair pointer. And uh, she lives out on the farm mm -hmm. where she gets uh, uh, plenty of running time. And that's why we're here today. That's why I brought her today. Exactly. Because everybody who She's follows along with the Westminster Dog Show, which was yeah. just last week, uh, we found out that this was the type of dog that breed. won right. the breed. Right. Mm -hmm. The CJ from Southern California. Here's what CJ uh, looks like. Right. Yeah. CJ. Good looking dog. Beautiful dog. And there's always a spike of the, of the breed that wins Westminster. Just like there's a spike like when Marley and me, you know, the yellow labs. And here you go. She's not used to being on TV. Mm -hmm. And uh, so what, what we wanted to talk about today was German short hairs are beautiful, beautiful dogs, but there's probably a really good reason why they're not perfect for everybody's household. Okay. And what, what, what kind of household are we talking about? We're talking, these dogs, I live on a farm, so I have lots of room for pointers to run. I have two pointers mm -hmm. and they, uh, they, they run, they, they, you know, they chase squirrels, they, they have themselves a big time. These dogs are, so, they're not just high energy, they're extreme high energy. They're, they're hyperactive? They're, they're hyperactive, particularly the young ones. Mm -hmm. um, you know, seniors are a little different. They're a little more quiet, like it, all breeds. But these dogs need a very, very active family. This is not a dog you can put in a crate for 10 hours a day, um, take it out, and think you're going to get anything that it resembles normal. Um, they just, um, they require, Treats. sure, okay. they require a lot of attention, a lot of activity. Um, it's funny, uh, a Facebook group I'm on for German short hair pointers, when people get a pointer and they're like, oh my gosh, I didn't realize, you know, what What do I do? What do I do? The most common response is get another pointer because then they can at least yeah, keep them occupied. Yeah. Exactly. And they can tire each other out. Exactly. But very so, curious dogs, it looks like, too. Very, well, they're, hunt, they're bred for hunting. Yeah. Um, you know, CJ's a show dog. He, he, he most likely doesn't hunt, mm -hmm. but these guys are bred for hunting. Um, they're bred to go all day long out in the field. <laughs> And they're, apparently they're bred to wine. Um, <laughs> they're uh, so, so they have that built in. That you know they're 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 made for it. Mm -hmm. So you need a household that where you've got you know real active family, uh, real you know maybe biking and hiking, and they need a walk around the block won't get it. Yeah, their motor's always running. A great way to put it. Mm -hmm. Great way to put it. So the um, there, that's why there's a lot of them in rescue. You know you'll you'll almost always find a pointer or pointer <laughs> really? mix the ARL. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And in uh, in Iowa, we have an incredible rescue organization, Great Plains Pointer Rescue. Okay. Uh, it's greatpointers.org. Our, our Iowa rescue uh, for pointers covers Nebraska and Iowa. And these are, they're, they're always in the Great Iowa Pet Expo. They're a wonderful group uh, because they understand these dogs mm -hmm. and they have an, a, a complete foster network. So they have lots of families, you know, they don't have a building anywhere. They have okay. lots of families that take these dogs and work with them and, you know, before you adopt them, you, you know, you know that their house broke they've got some commands you know their their quirks you know there's one in in there right now that's a fence jumper uh, a lot of these dogs because they're bred to hunt don't get along with cats Libby does but she was raised in a household with cats okay um, so uh, and that's why I selected her actually mm -hmm. because she could get along with cats so I wanted to talk a little bit about um, Great Plains Point of Rescue because these uh, the dogs that come out of there are totally vetted um, it is $275 to adopt one of these dogs but you know what you're getting it's not like you're you Know, getting a dog that's just you know somebody's handing it to you at a rest stop and or something. And have it bounce off the walls. Right, right, right. and uh, they um, they they help you with your dog. They help you. You know, they understand pointers. They will qualify you and, and, and let you know if you're a pointer family. Mm -hmm. So we've got a couple of them. Uh, Let's that take we a can look at some up. of these here, shall we? Uh, there we go. Um, Charlie. Charlie came out of a puppy mill. Had been a breeding dog and is now in a, in a foster home. Uh, I love Baron. Baron looks a little <laughs> bit like my English pointer. Uh, Baron's very expressive and uh, of, of both these dogs are adoptable. Luna, who looks very much like Libby with the dark right. uh, liver head and, and ticking, uh, came from a situation, again, people had her for 17 months, just never got couldn't her trained, get a handle on it. couldn't get a handle on it, couldn't, couldn't create the time. 
and so she ended up in rescue. Got it. So now she's looking for a home. And, and then hey, Mo, hey, Mo. Mo is our, as a senior. Mo is, uh, he's an older dog, and I'll tell you, I've, I've rescued seniors before, a senior pointer, and they're, they're so classy. Mm -hmm. my, my experience. So is he slowing down a little bit then? Yes. Mo's slowing down. Mo's, Mo's a quieter dog. He's uh, probably not going to be a dog you're going to have for a long time. Mm -hmm. You know, it's, Mo may be a two to three year a dog. Okay. But the neat thing about the seniors in this in this group mm -hmm. is that they um, they're only a hundred dollars. Okay, um, they, they, they give you some incentive to pick them right, up. Right, right. And the group also, um, um, when you get your dog, it comes. It's totally vaccinated. Everything you can imagine has been taken care of in advance, so your dog is good to go mm -hmm. for that next year on the basics. Right. So uh, so anyway, that's kind of the rundown on German. So Shorter again, pointers. just because it was the the winner at the dog show, people are going to go out looking for him now because right. that might be their first first exposure to him. Exactly. Exactly. They're like, oh my gosh, beautiful dog. I mean, CJ carried himself so classy. Mm -hmm. You know, he's so elegant. And you go, my gosh, I want a dog like that. That's a dog that has had years of training. Mm -hmm. um, most of them um, are just want. All they want to do is run. That you know, they 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 are prey dogs. They are built for it. They even have webbed feet for you know uh, getting going through the water. Mm -hmm. um, Libby, can you sit? They're just good girl. Oh yeah, we know we know a few things. Yeah. But they're just made for that kind of lifestyle. Mm -hmm. So if you don't have that kind of lifestyle, get a senior or find a dog, you know, get a basset hound. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> don't, don't mind a little snoring. No, yeah. but if you have that kind of lifestyle, these are the biggest cuddle bugs. Mm -hmm. uh, Libby, I have to put a gate up so to keep her out of the bed. Right. Um, they just, they, they want it, they think they're lap dogs and couch potatoes. Mm -hmm. They are wonderful family dogs. But as, again, as long as the family is active and can give the dog, you know, goes to the, can go to the dog park every day. You need to wear their battery down. Exactly, mm -hmm. and it's, it, it's every day. Mm -hmm. So. I just wanted to let people know that's the kind of commitment, you know, or you live on a farm. Mm -hmm. Libby has um, three acres that is uh, protected with underground fence, mm -hmm. so she and her other pointer sister can run and play. The and, pointer yeah. sister, you yeah, they're the, okay, okay. I kind of call them the <laughs> twisted sisters, but uh, <laughs> but they, uh, you know, they have the room to run, that's and great. and they can they can do that. And uh, well, now she's a good TV dog. Mm -hmm. um, but that's that's the scoop on pointers. So um, great to watch the movies where you see a breed. I guess the basic message is no matter what uptick you see in a breed do your homework and and the rescue that you mentioned again what's the name of the rescue great great pointers dot org mm -hmm. and they um, they have all their all their rescues are in foster so you can talk to the people that the dog has been living with and they'll tell you you know does it does he does he want to get in the trash well yeah maybe he's done it this one uh, when you're just when you're not looking counter surfer oh really I caught her with her little paws up there just, just surveying. checking things just, out just in okay. case that's you all know, right she needs needs but to know you know there. so you know to keep things away from the edge of the Counter. Right, okay. exactly. And so you need uh, to learn before you just go out and grab a dog. Right, like this. and you know they're very smart. And uh, just just when you think you got their number, they you learn that uh, maybe they have yours. That is awesome. <laughs> well, Libby, you did good. Good job, young lady. Good girl. Now uh, we want more information about things that are going on. They can follow your website, right? Right. There's always MuscleBump.com, mm -hmm. GreatIowaPetExpo.com, and uh, give us a ring. Let us know. And if you want to know anything about the uh, uh, great. Plains Pointer Rescue. Mm -hmm. You can give us a call, but go to greatpointers.org. All right, wonderful. Thank you, Libby. You did a good job. <laughs>